it's a Friday. Not much going on, but of course I'm going to be giving films away. It's a Friday. That's what I do on a Friday. Now, there has been a bit of hoo-ha in the old Blu-ray forums today with a, a certain gentleman being kicked out. For reasons which he won't ever admit to. And no doubt you'll probably get some comments on some of my videos from this gentleman. And he'd be slagging me off. I don't care. It was bullying. And it's sorted now. So, yeah, I've probably lost a couple of subscribers because of it. Because obviously he's not going to admit to anything. But there you go. Just to let you know, if you see any weird or slaggings off on me on a video, then you know why. Because I've stood up to somebody and he's been kicked off a load of forums. So there you go. But enjoy the rest of your weekend anyway, guys. You know what I mean? Now, let's say, take a look. I've had a few things come in. And then we'll get the competition part done as well for you, so we won't keep you too long tonight. Now, one thing that I did find is my neighbour Totoro finally turned up. Um, everything else turned up in one go. Why this came separately, I don't know, but it came with a slip, so I'm happy. I only need two more now. Uh, something which is Stublio Jubilee S, but a bit newer. Not, I don't think it's from the, it's from the same kind of artist, but not the actual same studio is Mary and the Witch's Flower. I'm not sure if I showed this already, but it's a still book. I'm looking to get it normal as well. Beautiful artwork on that one. Um, also, on any Sunday, um, it's a modern take on the original biking classic um, from a documentary back in the day. It costs like 70p. So, you know, the visuals on it are really well done on that. I couldn't remember if I had this, and I still haven't looked. And of course, with Blu-ray.com still down, you can't check for a release station. You can't check your own filing system of what you've got so until that's back up I think I might have a leak squad but if not for the 50p it cost me who cares if I've got it I'll give it to you a bit of a rare one this uh, Tekken 2 I've been looking for this for a long time it's the first time I've seen it so that's going to be in the collection I had Predator in 3D and I forgot where I sold that I had actually picked it back up so Predator again had to get that this one's been staring me in the face in this charity shot and it was like 30p. It's the Kenny Daglish documentary, but 30p, it's another, if it's really, really crap, at least I've got another Amaray case. And finally, finally, I have Green Street. Finally. Two and three, easy to find. You can never get one, but I've got it finally. Also picked up a copy of Salt. Brutal film this, the way she watches her husband. Oh, he, oh, I'm not going to spoil it. But, Salt and 4K, and finally, complete my Marvels, I have Age of Ultron in 4K, and we can thank Rob for that, because he sent me the money for my birthday for that one, so thank you, Rob. Now, um, as you know, with the live shoes, me, me, Rob, and all of that, we've been getting on like a house on fire, so... Uh, Rob's going to take a few days off of a few things just to sort out a couple of things. You know, if you, your headspace isn't right, then you don't want to do this kind of thing at the moment. So he's taking a few days back to chill and sort a few things out. But, you know, Rob, we're here if you need us, mate. And we'll look forward to you coming back. Now, again, thank you so much for your parcel. It's amazing. Um, obviously, you got my parcel as well, so you saw that. Uh, your other ones are on their way already for you, so you, when you get those, you know what's going to happen with that as well. Now, let's get on to the important part. One, yes, the live stream is on Sunday, and it's about it's a quiz one, so it's going to be fun, and Big Paulie's going to be there, so make sure you tune in for that one. I'm actually going to be on uh, Jason Brett, isn't it? I'm on Jason's Brett live stream sometime next week. I, got, I can't think it's the 28th, I can't remember the date. I'm going to have to contact him and find out, but I'm going to be on somebody else's live stream later next week as well, so look out for that. Jason Brett is, is definitely his name. And um, it's looking good, so I'm enjoying it. Now, for competition-wise, I thought I'd go a bit hard, hard man, hard ass, and a bit kiddie. So what we have is the extended director's cut of Expendables and Olympus Has Fallen. I mean, let's face it, I, I fucking love Olympus Has Fallen. But I thought a couple of nice hard man films that's your first one and if we went for kiddies I went for this is like the first, one of the first blu-rays I ever bought a copy of open season and if you haven't seen this it is hilarious and I'm backing it up with a brand new copy of Casper which is an awesome film 
So that guys is your prizes for tonight. Let's get the minions head and see what we can give away, shall we? Oh, got one straight away. So and this is weird because I've got to send him a parcel next week. The winner of the two um, the Action Man ones, which is the Olympus has fallen and the Expendables Director's Cut, is Jason Laverick. Cool dude. He's got some stuff due to him anyway, so that'd be saving some money on a parcel. Next, for the kiddie ones, who's going to win some kiddie stuff? Right, I have one. So the winner of Casper and what was the other one? An open season is Gurpreet Barrier. Been a while since I pulled you out, son, but you know, you know, you know. Very cool. That's your prizes for this week, guys. Now, I've, I've, apparently, I've got a couple of other parcels due to me at some point, so I'll remember I will carry on the subscriber mails as a separate entity now as well, because one is very much appreciated, and I want to make sure that. I highlight anybody who gives me anything because I want everyone's channels to grow around here. It's a great laugh and I'm really enjoying it. Simple as that. Now everyone enjoy your weekend. Try to stay alive. Um, it's, if Blu-ray.com comes back up, obviously I will try to get my uh, release information for the rest of the world onto Facebook, but without it, it's kind of hard. So hopefully they'll get themselves sorted out by this weekend. I've got like a hundred titles I need to put into my uh, data bank, but I can't do it right now, so it's a pain in the arse. Let me know. Let me know in the comments down below how's it affecting you guys as well. Sorry, it's a short one tonight, but obviously there's not too much else to talk about. There's no other sales going on that are changing or anything like that. Um, even Zavi's big weekend helps if you actually change the prices, guys. It's fuck all change, so you, you assholes. Fucking Zavi, I don't know. Um, the only decent thing going on right now, um, Zoom have the 4K of the Ten Commandments for $13.99. But they'll only set PayPal payments. One of those is coming my way. Take care now. Have a good weekend, guys. Bye.